Huh? Okay, Lily Mae, could you give us your full name and spell it for us, please? Lily Mae Schuyler. Could you spell it? L I L L I E M E Y M A E J O H N. I'm sorry, oh, could you <laughs> slow down and do that once again, please? L I L L I E, you better go past because I didn't want to get it out. M A E. And the last S C H U I L E R. I'm sorry, it's just a little too quick. S C H U I L E R. You got it? S-E-A- you better have it. U I L E R. <laughs> Skyler. Yes. And your maiden Assholes. name? Your maiden name? John. Did you spell it first? D O H N. Okay, where were you born, Lily May? Wittenberg, I think. I don't know. Wittenberg, it, I think. What was the date of your birth? June 25th. What year? 21. 1920. June, June 20, yeah. June 21st? June, June 25th. June 25th, in what yeah. year? Uh, 21. 1921? Yeah. Okay, what were the name of your parents? Thomas John and Minnie. What her maiden name? <coughs> Excuse me. One her maiden name? Yeah. Uh, John. Uh, Elm. She was an Elm. Your mother was an Elm? Yeah. Okay. Minnie Elm. Okay. And did, did they have any brothers and sisters that you knew? On your father's side, did he have any brothers? My, bro- uh, my dad did. William John. William John was yeah. your brother? Yeah, they lived around Wittenberg. I don't know who. No. Did your mother have any sisters or brothers that you yeah, knew? Yeah, Lily, Lily John. Lily John? Mm-hmm. Neva May's. Neva May's mother? Yeah. Okay. Is that the only sister she had that you knew? So. Yeah, I don't know. Oh. Just, I know her. Did, you, did your mother or your father ever talk about going to any boarding school anywhere? Was this Philandro uh, boarding school? Yeah. My mom went there. Your mother went to Flandre boarding school? I don't know about my dad, though. Oh, okay. Did your parents talk Oneida? Mm-hmm. Can you talk Oneida? We, I used to. I don't know now, but I can understand it. Oh, okay. You kind of lose it after a while when you don't talk it? Yeah. Well, the rest of the kids don't. Oh, you know. just you? Yeah. <laughs> I'm the only one that yeah. can, you know. Yeah. And do you have any sisters and brothers? Grace. Grace Bear. Mm-hmm. Grace Bear, Grace John was Grace Bear now, mm-hmm. and uh, Mary, Mary Wilbur, mm-hmm. she's gone too, and uh, who else? Mabel, Mabel Ninham. See to me, Grace, Mabel, me. Yeah, that's all. And brothers? Ivor and Basil and Benny and Al. Okay. Are they all living? Are they? Gone to no, Ivor's gone. I don't know about the rest Ivor. of them. Mm-hmm. Elders? Well, Elders living yet, yeah. Elders, Elders in Oneida? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. <coughs> and where, where were you raised, uh, Lily Mae? In Wittenberg. In Wittenberg? Mm-hmm. Did you go to a boarding school at all? We went to Toma in Wittenberg, and that's about, well, no, Toma was in, I don't know. You went to Toma and Wittenberg? Toma and Wittenberg, yeah. Oh, okay. Do you, do you know how long you went to school there? That till sixth grade, I think. Till the sixth grade? Mm-hmm. Did you go to any school after that? Yeah, in, uh, in Shell Lake we went to day school. Okay. High sc- uh, day school, yeah, that's what they called them, day school. Did you, is, that, is that the same as high school? Yeah, no, that's uh, Tozer Lake is the day school. Oh, okay. Tozer. And did you go to high school too? No. No? You just went through the grade yeah, school. Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay. Did you know what kind of work your uh, father did? Well, he was mostly a woodcutter, I guess. I don't. Woodcutter. Yeah. Oh, okay. He worked out in the woods, anyhow. Oh. I don't know what if he did anything else. Did your mother work outside the home? Yeah, she did housework. Oh, okay. And where did she do the housework at? In Green Bay. In Green Bay. Yeah. Okay. I don't know if she worked any other place. Just Green Bay. Did you know? Did you know your grandparents' names at all? No. I mean, other than your great grandparents, I no. should say. Uh-uh. What uh, What church did your uh, parents belong to? Used to be uh, Lutheran. Lutheran. Yeah. Oh, okay. And now we're Episcopals. You're Episcopals now. Okay. Mm-hmm. Here at Oneida, are you, do you belong yeah, to the Episcopal Oneida. Church in Oneida? 
I don't go to church otherwise. And when you, when you were growing up, Lily Mae, do you remember um, uh, what you did for uh, entertainment? Did, did you play any kind of games or no. anything that Just you can ordinary, remember? Just ordinary games, that's all. You Tut. can't remember what they were called? No? Uh -uh. Okay. Did your mother or your father ever tell you old, any old uh, stories or legends? About Oneidas or Oneida? Yeah. The, a legend would be like an axe in the tree for yeah, storms. Yeah. yeah, you got that too, haven't you? Yeah. Can you yeah. tell me about it a little bit? Well, at the time the storm came, we should, we, he t they'd read them and tell us to go get an axe and put it in the tree. Uh huh. It's the storm was supposed to go away. <laughs> Did the storm usually go away? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. I don't know. Maybe it did. I don't know. And did you do any work, Lily Bay? Just housework. Housework? Yeah. Did you ever go, like, to Sturgeon Bay or anything oh, when yeah, you were small? Picking, yeah. Picking cherries? Uh-huh. Yeah. And who did you go with you when you went to pick cherries? Did you go as a child? Yeah, Yeah, we went with our folks. Oh, okay. Yeah. And did you stay there while you picked mm -hmm. the cherries? Martins. Oh, okay. And Sawyer. I know we went some other places, too, but I can't remember names. Okay. Did you have uh, electricity and running water when you were growing up? No. No? It's just at school. At school, you said, no. but not at home. And was your home in Wittenberg? Yeah, most of the time around Wittenberg. Oh. Till it died in those little towns. Oh, okay. Elon, you know. Elon? Yeah. You lived there too for a little while? But I, don't, I can't remember when, where we lived. Oh, okay. Oh, we lived in Shano, that's... Shano, let me see now. Yeah, Shano. Mm -hmm. They took us and... I know my mom and dad parted and they took us kids when we were little and with, that's where we landed in Shano. Oh, okay. And who did you live with when you were in Shano then? We stayed with our dad till he died there. Oh, and we, okay. we went back to school and... Oh, okay. Your dad died while he, while you were living in Shano? Mm -hmm. How old were you when that happened? About five, I guess, six. Oh, you were quite yeah. young at that. Oh, okay. Little farts. <laughs> Do you remember <laughs> any kind of um, specific games that you played when you were, when you were children? Tag. Tag? Jump rope. Jump rope? <laughs> mm-hmm. Basketball. A little bit. Basketball. Mm -hmm. <coughs> baseball. And baseball, too? Oh, well, you played quite a few mm -hmm. games, yeah. Otherwise, I don't know. Nothing yeah. else. Did your mother ever tell you about any kind of uh, herbs that they used for medicines? Oh, yeah. Do you remember the names of any of them? Uh, what is that? Wintergreen or tea? Yeah. I know, I know we had... You don't remember the names no. of the herbs? But, but did they always make a tea out of the herbs? Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, but I, I, could, I could remember a lot of that stuff, but I just don't remember them now. It's because I'm so mad. <laughs> <laughs> Get over being mad. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I got a temper. Okay. Did your, did your mother or your father practice any cultural traditions? Uh -uh. No? None that you know? But they did both speak Oneida. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We used to all speak it till we went to school. And Th then you lost it after you went to school? Yeah, I can speak it a little bit. I understand it. Uh huh. I can't talk it. Do you remember any of the holidays when you were growing up? Yeah. Christmas mostly. Christmas East, mostly? East, no, Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving? Uh-huh. And what did you do at Thanksgiving? We had we had uh, chicken, I think, chicken or duck or whatever. Uh-huh. All that good stuff. All that good stuff? Yeah. <laughs> did you have any um, anything at Christmas time? Yeah, we used to have good, good presents. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they were homemade. 
Did you have a Christmas tree? Yeah, uh -huh. we always had a Christmas tree. And I remember the Christmas tree at uh, Wittenberg, too. Because mm -hmm. they used to cover it up with a sheet so we wouldn't see it right away. Oh, was that at the school? Yeah, and then they used candles. Oh. And they had uh, Christmas Eve, they lit, lit, I light the candles. Mm -hmm. and all I could think of was fire. Oh. <laughs> There was no fire, though, was there? No, <laughs> darn it. <laughs> that that was fun, though. That was nice. Christmas Eve, they would take the sheet off and light yeah. the candles. Oh, that's yes. different. You try that today, I bet you there'd be a lot of fires. Oh, I guess so. <laughs> <laughs> the way the kids are now, holy fright. <laughs> hmm. Did you have any special chores that you had to do when you were oh, young? Oh, yeah, we had a hole in wood and empty the ashes and light to, to fill up the the, la uh, the lamps with kerosene and clean the chimneys and all that. All that good stuff. All that good stuff. <laughs> all that good stuff. Mm. Yeah, hot water. You didn't have a well? No. How far did you have Oh, to sometimes a long, long ways. Oh, yeah? It take us about three hours. Oh, really? <laughs> to get the water. Mm -hmm. you, didn't did you, you didn't have electricity, but you no, had lamps? Uh, lamps. Oh, okay. Lamps and a lantern. Mm -hmm. So, do you take advantage of any of the uh, Oneida elderly programs that they have? No. No? You're too far away? Too far away. <laughs> what about the, um, the per capita? What do you think about the per capita? That's good. No. Good. Helps you? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. That helps a lot. Yeah. Especially if you got the print rent to pay, you know. Yeah. Where are you living now, Lily? Nakusa. Nakusa? Uh-huh. That's a nice little town, though. It's a nice little town? Uh-huh. -huh. Is it very far? From Oneida, I mean? Yeah, I think it is. I don't know couple hours yeah. or so? It's a cranberry marsh. You know where the cranberry marsh is? Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. All right. Okay. Don't ask me which way to go, though. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember um, the tribal members at one time getting 52 cents from the yeah. government? We used to get 50, 50 cents there for a while. 50 cents? Mm -hmm. And it, I think it went up to 51 and... And, and 52. The, and the big one was 52. <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever get to see those checks? I never got to see them. No. Uh -uh. But that was a big deal. <laughs> yeah. How was it when you, when you were at boarding school? It was nice, you know, because you, know, you had your chores to do. Uh-huh. Yeah, every, every week, I think, every two weeks, it changed your... Chores, you know, you, you didn't do everything all at once. Oh, okay. You even learned learn how to make bread. Oh, that was good. The good bread. Yeah. Uh -huh. Not that button bread. <laughs> <laughs> the good stuff. So they, they probably prepared all of their foods right there at the school? Mm-hmm. Did you ever have a garden when you were growing up? Yeah, we had a garden. We had everything. everything. Beans, potatoes, cabbage, corn, everything. Did your mother do any canning at all? No, our foster mother did, though. Your foster no, mother did? Yeah, she, who was your foster mother? Lone Star. Lone Star? Yeah, she was Chippewa. She was Chippewa? Yeah. Oh. She did everything like that. And where was that at? At Shell Lake. At Shell Lake? Mm-hmm. Okay. And so we did all the canning, picked berries, picked blueberries, mm -hmm. and whatever kind of stuff we could get, we canned them. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Did she have a last name, or was that her last name, Lone Star? Lone Star, yeah. That's the only name you knew her by? Mm -hmm. We used to call her Ann Becky. Oh, okay. Ann Becky, yeah. Can I ask a good question, Lois? Mm -hmm. How did you end up in Shell Lake? Foster parent. We were, we were sent out from Toma. Okay. Foster. That, that's foster that's when they were sending all those kids all over, you know. There's a lot of kids that got to know. We weren't, some of them, I guess, got adopted, but we didn't get adopted. There was too many of us, I think. Oh, so they just sent you to foster homes? Yeah. 
But that was nice. Mm -hmm. we, I loved it there. They were Indian, they were Chippewas. Mm -hmm. So we, we, we had one of the best ones. Did all of you get to go there or did you get separated? No, we got there. You we would have we 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 been separated that, uh, that lady at the, uh, she worked from Toma, I mean Sparta. Mm -hmm. She told the boys to get out, mm -hmm. you know. She said, the, the lady only wanted boys. I says, oh no, I says, you're not getting out. I told the kids to lock the doors. We wouldn't open them and <laughs> she let us all go. <laughs> she let you all go to the same home? Mm -hmm. That was nice. That was good, yeah. Mm -hmm. So how long did you stay there in the foster I stayed there till I was about 16, I guess. Oh, okay. The rest of them, I guess, stayed longer. Mm -hmm. I think Grace went to high school. No, she went to high school there. Oh, okay. But you didn't go to high school? No. There? I think she graduated there too. I really don't know. Mm -hmm. Were you ever involved in any kind of uh, sports activities at all when you were in Just school? Just around home, that's all. That's Just baseball. at home, nothing in school? Mm -mm. Baseball, that's all. Do you, do you practice any kind of cultural traditions? Make corn soup. Make corn soup? Yeah. Good. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like the bread, so I don't make the bread. <laughs> you don't make the bread? I don't like the bread. Just the corn soup? Just the corn soup, uh-huh. Oh, okay. I can make that. Mm -hmm. And fried bread. And fried bread, you mean? And the gaslihado. Yeah. And that's all, I guess. That's well, that's all. enough. Yeah, that is. That's a yeah, lot. That's a lot. <laughs> oh, let me see. What else do we need to ask you? Do you remember any of the old street names in Oneida? South Park Avenue. South Park Avenue? Any other one? That's where, that's where Prudence, you know where Prudence uh -huh. lives? Yeah. That street going that way, that's South Park Avenue. South Park Avenue? I don't know what the rest of the street, that's the only one I knew of, South Park. You remember that one, huh? Uh -huh. Do you remember how old Oneida used to be? What was in Oneida? Farmer oh, store. The what? Farmer store and uh, Morgan's, I think, and the drug store. I think, that, yeah, the post office was there too. Mm -hmm. Not the not the one down the hill. I mean, wherever it is yeah. now. Mm -hmm. it was on the top one of that the was hill. right yeah. in Oneida. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What else? I don't know what else was there. Creamery. Well, that was connected to the farmer store. Schrader's. Yeah. Yeah. Anything drug else store you was remember? there. The drugstore? Mm hmm. I think that's about all. Oh, that's all I remember. Can I jump in? Sure. Uh, something I'm a little confused about. If you grew up in other places, did you spend any of your childhood growing up in Oneida? No, we stayed about a year, maybe, not even a year, I don't think. Because I'm wondering how you got to know old Oneida. Well, you get to know it when you were little. <laughs> Did you visit here a lot, or? Yeah, well, we, well, we stayed with Celinda Webster. Remember her, old witch? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> we should find her now. <laughs> you stayed with her for yeah. a while? Yeah, oh yeah, well, yeah, well, she kept us one, one summer. Oh, okay. That was after our dad died, she kept us. Oh. Ooh. And then you after that. You know what I know now, boy. <laughs> <laughs> then after that, you went over to uh, the other place? Yeah. Hmm? I didn't hear her family. Did she have a family? You mean herself? No, I didn't ask her oh, that yet. Huh? Did you have any children yourself? No. No? Okay. So just your brothers and sisters were your family? Mm-hmm. That's all. Is there any, uh, any other stories that you remember that you'd like to ta talk about? No. Any other kind of stories from the schools? Oh, I, I took care of Katie Swamp. You remember Katie Swamp? Uh, no, Anton I Anton Swamp, I took care of her for a little while. Oh, okay. That's Art Skinnador's mother. 
Oh, okay. Her, I took care of her for a little while. Mm -hmm. I used to work around, you know. It was was after, after you grew up, you used to work around on yeah. Just a little while, you know, maybe a couple of weeks. Whenever they wanted me, I just went and worked. You were kind of like a living yeah. caretaker? That was fun, though. Yeah. You enjoyed doing that kind yeah. of work? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I wish I could do it now. <laughs> well, How? Did you notice any difference between, uh, you know, the other tribes when you lived in some of the areas with the Chippewa or the Ho-Chunk or Panamis? Did you do things a little bit different than the United we, States? We didn't do, we went around those other tribes. Huh? We just seen them. The you Chippewa, know. though, you said you lived with. She was that a she was a Chippewa, but yeah. she lived uh, mostly by her. They, they lived by themselves mostly, you know. She was. She used to be in. Uh, she used to work in a restaurant someplace. Oh. But they were all, but you know, mostly by themselves. There was no reservation where they lived. Some place or Sand Lake or Sand or something. Sand something. I don't know. Did they, you, Did you think they were different than the Oneidas, or were they no, pretty much uh -uh. the same? They were the same. I didn't think so. The only ones were the different were the Winnebago's. Oh, uh -huh. the, they talked in. They talked their language all the time, just like the Oneidas do. Mm -hmm. You know, they talked their own language. Oneidas did. Yeah. yeah. But I can't talk it now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I wish I could. Do you use the, the Oneida Health Center at all? Huh? Do you use the Oneida Health Center at all? No. No? Too far away? Okay. Yeah, I wish I could. I go every day, every other day. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Is there anything else that you'd like to No, tell I don't think so. No? Is there any questions we missed you? No, I don't think so. Okay. Well, I guess the only thing I could think of would be maybe the advice to youth. Oh, yeah. What kind of advice would you give to the youth of today? To the youth this uh -huh, day? Yeah. If they could speak the Oneida language, just keep it up. You know. Okay. Because that's really going, I think. Mm -hmm. It's It's been going a long time since I was a little kid. I think they, it went. Would you like to see that come yeah, back? Yeah, I would. Mm -hmm. But some school, where was that we went to in time and they told us we, should, we couldn't... Uh, we couldn't speak our language. Oh. Okay. We had to speak the English language. What's but that everybody one of the asked them, but the Winnebago's didn't. <laughs> was that one of the boarding schools you went to? No. Yeah, the, the, like a Toma. Oh. You know. They were, were there the, other different, were there different tribes that went to school? Yeah, there was the Chippewas and Winnebago's and Oneidas. Potawatomi. But the Potawatomi didn't, you know, speak their, you know, they Maybe they did, I don't know, but the Winnebago's, they did, all the time. Did the Chippewas speak theirs too? No. No? Once in a great while, I guess. But the Winnebago's, they were going every day, every day, every day. Mm -hmm. They still do? Yeah, they still do. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else back there? I don't think so. No? Well, I want to thank you, Lily Mae, yeah. for coming today. Yeah. And just stay <laughs>